Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So in this video, I will tell you how to fix enable to turn off the do not disturb mode on iPhone. Do not disturb mode is really a good thing for other users who do not like to be bothered with all the notifications, especially when they are busy with their other work. But many iPhone users are encountering an issue with their iPhone recently where they are unable to turn off the do not disturb mode. So in this video, I will tell you how can you fix this issue. But first, subscribe to my channel and hit the like button. So let's start the video without wasting any time. So the first thing you should go for turn off the do not disturb mode manually. Launch the control center screen on your iPhone by swiping down the screen from the top right side. After you see the control center screen, look for the focus option and do a single tap on it. And then tap on the do not disturb to disable it and you are done and the next step is delete any schedule created in do not disturb mode for this open the settings page tap on it after you open the settings app go to the focus option now select the do not disturb option at the top scroll down to set a schedule section and select the schedule which was created earlier for the do not disturb mode Tap on the delete schedule option. Tap on again delete schedule to confirm. This will delete any schedule created for do not disturb and will avoid enabling do not disturb automatically as per the schedule and you are done. And the next step is restart the iPhone. Many times if there are any conflicting bugs within the iPhone, it can create such problems to restore restart the iPhone once to eliminate all these bugs from your iPhone and resolve this issue for this go to the settings page tap on it scroll down and then tap on general scroll down to the bottom and then tap on shut down and then slide to power off and after some time press and hold the power button until you see the Apple logo and you are done and the next step is update the iPhone. This kind of issue arises if the user has not installed the recent update released by Apple. This update might contain bug fixes, enhancement features etc. And your iPhone might be missing all of them since it is not been installed. So we suggest as a general practice to keep your iPhone software updated. For this go to the settings page on your iPhone. Scroll down and then tap on general and then tap on software update. Wait until the page is loading. See if there is any update available then tap on install now option to install the latest version and you are done. 